Welcome, Virgos. Virgo, Sun, Moon, and Rising. Virgos, it's going to be a good month. And why? Scorpions are having a um, moment. Scorpions is having their birthday, Virgos. And you, Virgos, your frequency is coming in in the third and fourth week. So, Virgos, this is absolutely, absolutely fantastic for you, Virgos, okay? It's going to be a very beautiful time, extremely beautiful. So, Virgos, before I do, let's get in your reading. The first week, Prudence, the Eight of Pentacles. So, this is good. Um, Really wonderful news coming in the first week, huh? A lot of you, Virgos, some sort of a new start that a friend wanted. It's not going to be coming in. Mm, yes. So this is a situation where a Sagittarian or a Leo could have wanted some sort of a new start. It's not going to be coming in. A lot of you um, are having problems with a Sagittarian and a Leo at the workplace. This is going to come up. The struggle, the fight is over. Some of you were having struggle and fight with a job, with a project. It is over. A lot of you were having inner struggle. It is over. People are now gaining a whole lot of understanding of a situation that was happening either at the workplace or at home. Okay. Um, then happiness and joy um, is going to be coming back at the workplace um, because someone is leaving. This person was creating a lot of chaos. So. Then we have the prince, the prince of disc. Now, this energy of the prince of disc is a Taurus, and they're gaining a whole lot of understanding of who is a Taurus. So, seven of sword, deceptiveness. They recognize that a Taurus formulates some sort of a documentation, and they caught this Taurus. So, um, the two of cups. Um, you Virgos could have been in love and had hope. Um, that you and an Aquarian would have uh, connect, it's not going to be happening, okay? A relationship with an Aquarian that you Virgos wanted is not going to be happening. Four of uh, Wands. Uh, the energy of the Four of Wands. A lot of competition, competition that was going on is going to come to an end, Okay. Um, then we have strength, trying to find strength. There's deceptiveness. They recognize what a Libran has done with some sort of a contract and they're now recognizing. Um, the energy of an, a corporation institution from another country recognize uh, some fraud um, contract or fraud documentation or fraud um, business situation concerning you Virgos and your partners, you Virgos and a Cancer. Now, this is not for everyone. So, Virgos, um, there is deceptiveness um, uh, surrounding you Virgos in this month. Um, there is no question about this. Deceptiveness in love, deceptiveness in a corporation institution, um, deceptiveness. Because now they're gaining a lot of understanding. So they're seeing the truth to some sort of a fraud marriage contract that was created by you, Virgos. Okay. Um, it could be a situation that you recognize that you, Virgos, have some sort of a fraud documentation um, or you created this. Um, you, Virgos, could recognize that there's a fraud because in your house, Virgos, um, is the energy of the angman. So you Virgos are going to be finding out some sort, sort of a documentation information is fraud. Okay. So you could be caught. So Virgos, be aware of what you do in the month of November because you Virgos could be fr caught with fraud documentation and information. Um, some sort of a business that you Virgos uh, had. And a lot of you Virgos who was happy with a cancer, they're going to be finding out that the scans of papers or documents is not good. Okay. Um, a corporation is now onto a, a, um, onto a cancer because they recognize that a cancer is, um, is carrying details and information that is not theirs. Okay. And they are 
checking back fingerprints and that sort of a situation I recognize oh, oh no this is not the person okay so a cancer you pulled off a, a, um, a situation you and a cancer pulled off a situation and it blows up in your face so Virgos it can be a cancer who did it to you or you did it to a cancer um, a lot of you Virgos and your partners a lot of you there are issues coming up that is going to be affecting you so problems could be at the workplace so a whole lot of deceptive play but a corporation will recognize what i can say i've done okay a corporation is now gaining a lot of knowledge of what i can say i've done some sort of a new start that a friend wanted with you is not going to be happening um whoever this friend is and whatever that was going on is not going to be happening there's a lot of conflicts that we're going around that is going to come to an end okay a lot of you virgos is going to be happy to get over a situation that uh, that was happening around you it is as if you're going to be finding out a smart way in order to resolve some sort of a problematic situation a lot of you virgos um a friend um wanted a new start wanted to reconnect with you you're going to be saying no Sadness is here uh, for a young Sagittarian man. Um, uh, sadness for a Sagittarian. Sadness for your child. Sadness for um, a, a, someone could be passing away also. It could be a child, a, a, a young child. You're going to be successfully overcoming conflicts around money. Um, whatever that was going on um, regarding to your money Virgos um, this is going to be uh, this conflicts over money is going to come to an end you're going to be very successful now the first house and the second house is beautiful Virgos um, the first house is about yourself finding out a way to resolve a problematic situation the second house is about uh, your money and there is a lot of success over winning a conflict over a lot of money okay so a corporation institution is now getting to the bottom of a situation so virgo um if you have a company or you work in a corporation institution they're going to be recognizing something so virgo be aware okay I see that a lot of you Virgos want to reconnect with a Capricorn person. You Virgos are in love with a Capricorn person. You were in love with this Capricorn person. You want to reconnect with a Capricorn person. And it could be that you created a whole lot of chaos for a Capricorn person because you were in love with this person. You think this person was in love with you. And there were outside influence that created some sort of a chaos, okay? But it's as if you Virgos is going to be now recognizing, because it's as if you feel as if this person, because I see you want to return to this person, Virgos. And this is a Capricorn person. And you were, you had hoped to be with this person. You wanted to be with this person. You hope to be with this person. But it's as if you thought that this person didn't want to be with you. But that's basically not the point. I think there was too much outside influence. But we'll know why. But now you want to re return to a Capricorn person. Okay. Then as we look at the disc. Um, they now recognize how much money. Um because this is like um this is like um uh social media from a business how much money you virgos had gained from a business that was not based it it wasn't yours or it could have been someone else's idea or it could, vice versa and they're not going to be recognizing how much money and a Gemini is behind this. Regrets. 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 Regrets for a Libran man and his marriage. Regret for you, Virgos, that is in a relationship with a Libran man. Um, regrets for an Aquarian. 
because this is communication in Aquarian. This is the moon in Aquarian. And it's as if you Virgos, an Aquarian man falsified some documentation. A Libran and an Aquarian man falsified some documentation and they're caught. Now, it's as if this Libran man and this, this Libran man and this um, Aquarian man works in some sort of a government institution and created some sort of a false contractual agreement for you Virgos and they're caught. So I, I see this Libran man and this Aquarian man is now regretting what they have done. So... Um, a lot of you Virgos wanted some sort of a new contract for your partner or for your matey or your side piece chick. It's not going to be happening. Um, you paid an Aquarian and a Libran man in some sort of a government institution for them to access documentation and gave to a cancer who is your side piece chick or, um, you know, your sex or your partner. And they now recognize how this cancer got this contract that you Virgos had paid a civil servants to access data and information of a Capricorn person and give it to a cancer. And that's how a cancer got this contract and they're shutting it down. So they recognize that cancer is not who they say they are. No, um, still for a Aries woman. An Aries, an, an old Aries woman or a whole cancer woman is now in a whole lot of problems. This could be your mother or a family member, but this person has no strong foundation because they're now gaining a lot of knowledge of what this person has done. A legal issue has blown out of proportion and a scorpion, there is no, um, they're not recognizing what a scorpion, the, the connection of a scorpion in a situation um i see a scorpion is asking for a lawyer because they they recognize that they're in some serious serious uh, uh problem so a company that some of you virgos had run work for people are recognizing especially virgo businessmen a government institution is now investigating you Virgo's businessmen, okay? And this government institution is now recognizing what you Virgo businessmen have been doing. Um, and it is actually a little bit of human smuggling operation that you have been using your business to do, Virgo businessmen. And this is really Virgo businessmen, foreign investors. You were doing a little human smuggling operation and they're not going to be finding out what was going on in a corporation. So don't shoot the bird. So it is a really positive, positive month, but your partner, you Virgos could have used a Capricorn data and information to give your partner some sort of an entrance in a country and they're going to be canceled because people in authority recognize that this cancer is not the Capricorn. And it is a situation where a jealousy is formed, but it is a situation where you Virgos basically wanted to work against a Capricorn person. And it is a situation because they're now recognizing you Virgos was in love with this person. Okay. However, this is going on, whether it's you or someone else. So, um, so a Capricorn person is going to be successfully overcoming what you Virgos have done to them. Um, um, this Capricorn person is going to be recognizing that you Virgos has been, um, working them, working against them, their business, their self-employed and was using them, um, to make a lot of money off of them. Okay. Um, the energy of debt, the end, the transition, um, is here and the end and the debt and transition is for an Aries or a Leo person. Aries, Leo, or Sagittarian young woman wanted some sort of a new start. It's not coming in because they recognize who this person is. Now, the two of ones, it's like a lot of you Virgos wanted some sort of a new start, but it's not going to be happening. Um, they're now gaining a lot of understanding of a Pisces. Uh, a, a Pisces, but a Pisces could be finding out what you Virgos have done. Okay. 
Now, sadness for a Sagittarian young man or woman, Aries Lee or Sagittarian young man or woman, because they now recognize uh, what the Sagittarian young man or woman have done. So I see sadness for this person. A whole lot of worries concerning money is going to be coming up, but you will overcome this worries and concern about the money, okay? That is coming up. Um, they are now gaining a lot because I see they're getting down to the bottom of a situation concerning a home or at the workplace, but I see a lot of you Virgos have to be giving up and showing up details and documentation because they're now gaining a lot of understanding of what was going on. Communication, because they recognize you Virgos are not who you say you are, or you Virgos have created problems for a Capricorn and their partner. And whatever is going on, they recognize that a Capricorn and their partner is the original or spoke the truth, okay? So you Virgos, there is some sort of a communication, some sort of a problematic situation um, and a Capricorn and their partner and whatever is going on, it's kind of weird stuff, what is uh, basically happening. I see a lot of you Virgos are trying to protect yourself. Um, uh, and protect yourself, your money, and your business from a Gemini. Whoever this Gemini is and whatever is going on is as if you're like closing the door to a Gemini, um, whatever is transpiring or protecting your business and your finance. Help is going to be coming in because they now recognize but a Libran, that a Libran person created some sort of a contractual agreement for a Cancer and help is going to be coming in to resolve it. They recognize that this cancer have some sort of a false. So they caught a cancer with a contract and they recognize that this contract that this cancer carries is not for this cancer, but is for someone else. So I don't know if this cancer is your wife, your sweetheart. Um, some of you Virgos could have paid someone in a government institution organization to give a cancer some sort of a contractual agreement and this this because this sit in some sort of a contractual agreement for government so it could be travel documents uh, driver's license that sort of a thing they now recognize that this cancer is not who they say they are and it's carrying um documentation of someone else so it could be a cancer for some of you some of you is going to be a cancer some of you is going to be your partner. Some of you could be a kids that is held by government, um, could be a false ID that they have, that sort of a thing. Then we're looking at this Aries woman. I see people in order to recognize what an old cancer woman and an old Aries woman have done. Whoever this old cancer woman and this old Aries woman is, they're getting to the bottom of a situation. For some of you, it's your mother, your family, your mother and your um, aunt, that these two older people did something that was not above water. Now they're gaining understanding and recognizing that a Leo was pretending to be a scorpion. They're, they're catching a Leo. So you see, this problematic situation is that a Leo, a young Leo here is saddened because they recognize that a young Leo was pretending to be a scorpion. And here in the house of the scorpion, protection is there for the scorpion because people now recognize that's not the scorpion. Okay, where is the scorpion? So this young Leo, because here it is, is an Aries Leo or Sagittarian. And in the house of the Leo, a Leo um, was trying to get some sort of a, a new start. So however this is coming up for you guys, is that some sort of a communication that some of you were waiting on from a Sagittarius is not going to be coming in because they sit, they sit on a situation because they're trying to get to the bottom of a situation um, a, 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 a regarding um, a young Aries Lee or Sagittarius person. Okay. Um, and this is a serious situation that is transpiring. So a whole lot of you, problematic situation um, if you have Aries D or Sagittarian kids, um, Cancer, uh, Scorpion, Cancer and Scorpion kids are in problems. 
um, with like illegal documentation, driver's license, that sort of a thing, identification, that sort of a thing. Um, and uh, there is also a deceptive um, mess concerning uh, um, transition. Someone is going to be passing away. Before I go any further, someone is going to be passing away, Virgos. Okay. Now, it is not my whoever is passing away. Someone is passing away. Okay, so a lot of you are going to be getting debt of someone passing away. Now, your best house is going to be the house of money because you're going to be financially successful. Um, it's going to be the house of money. Um, in your house, Virgos, a lot of you Virgos are dealing with a home situation. You're dealing with a business situation. You're dealing with a problematic issue that concerns a house at the home front at work, a business, that is what you're dealing with. And um, it's as if they're recognizing what was going on because a Gemini person at the workplace is going to be finding out what you Virgos have done. Okay? Geminis can also be investigators. Okay? And if you are someone who was um, helping people to get government contracts and that sort of a thing, they're going to be shutting it down. All right. And um, a lot of you Virgos, I don't know what you have with a Capricorn, but Virgos and Capricorn is one of the best mates. And it's because the Capricorn is spiritual and psychic and you are also psychic. Uh, Virgos, you work with the Geminis. Uh, you carry the same energy, Mercury. Okay. Um, so... That is why um, you're now recognizing that a Capricorn is your best mate. Yes, a Capricorn is your best mate, okay? And I see a lot of you Virgos are moving back or trying to rekindle a relationship with a Capricorn because now you're recognizing uh, it's as if you met a Capricorn and someone intercept who was on the Capricorn phone and got in contact with you and told you lies and deceptiveness, which is a really criminal cancer um, that was pretending to be someone else, connected to some criminal organization, get you to access details and information for them, saying that they were the person and the right person was not the right person. This this child is mentally disturbed, is, is, is someone who is um, seriously mentally disturbed. And Virgos, and this is Virgos, and I hate it like it is. I love you guys to death because Virgos and Capricorn is really, we're like seriously off the chart when it comes to psychic. But if you decide, to create chaos for someone, you do it. And uh, then afterwards you recognize that's the wrong person. And that's exactly what happened. And it is a sad situation for you because I think uh, you know that this person was good for you. And you Virgos have to understand, you know you within your soul and then someone come with another piece of cake and you think, and listen to your your heart, your intuition, your guidance, your inner guidance, okay? Because the devil can come with the same nice piece of cake, but when you open the cake, it's full of worm. And that's exactly what you did. Because you let this cancer person manipulate you, okay? And, and, and play with your mental psychic. And now you recognize, oh my God, this little bloody person was not speaking the truth so you virgos are now going to it's going to be trying to find your way back to the capricorn person so this is a love it's not really a love triangle it is a situation where um it's as if this cancer had a mental problem because you know a lot of people don't recognize that 
and they want everything that someone else has. Ladies and gentlemen, if you want something that someone has, you are disturbed, okay? I'm sorry. It is what it is. Each and every person is, has come into this lifetime to create for themselves. So what another person has is not for you. If it was for you, the universe would have given you in the beginning. It is not for you, okay? So a lot of people in this cancer is so off the end, you know, and, and people can check themselves to recognize Am I normal? Am I in the space of normality? And I will teach you guys how to do that. But whenever you're obsessed over something, a life another person has, you block your own self because you're going to be doing anything to get that life where you know it's not yours. You were not born for it. You know, if you were born to have that life, the universe would have given you the right circumstances and the right situation. But then, and, and this is it, Virgos, because this is a beautiful, beautiful, and you know, it's unbelievably beautiful this, this month. And you guys get the best month because of... The scorpion and the two last week, Jupiter comes in with the Sagittarian and the Ophiosis. But you kind of, Virgos, you got to understand not everything that glitter is gold, okay? And uh, if you are connected with someone and you feel so deeply connected with a person, no matter what another person come and tell you about that person, you got to listen to your own intuition and your own feelings. And this is it. A lot of Virgos lose out on good relationship. But a lot of Virgos and typical Virgo men, you like to marry to someone who you would not really want. And you have another woman outside that is always the love of your life. It is... It is always. I, there's so much Virgos I can give the example of. The ones who are married with outside people. Because not everyone is the same. And this is basically the same situation. You were with a Capricorn. You went and go with a Scorpion or a Cancer. And now you recognize that the Scorpion and the Cancer just wanted papers. Just wanted documents. Just wanted something. And now it's going to be recognizing, oh my God. This person dragged me away from something that was good in order to get me into something that was, uh, you know, off the chart. But, you know, on the other side, a corporation institution, ooh, is, is, is going to be recognizing that this cancer, yes, because a corporation institution is going to be investigating a situation and you, uh, Virgos, is going to be winning some sort of a lawsuit because I see you, Virgos, are going to be saying, yes, you know, this person said that they were the person. That is why I gave them the information, not to really checking it because the person called up and said that they were the person. So this is how some of you, Virgos, are going to be getting out of a problems that a cancer or a scorpion have brought you in is because you're going to be just say, saying the truth. And I think... Uh, a lot of people do not understand, but some people just don't know um, what is true, you know. But a lot of you Virgos are now going to be recognizing the devastated situation, how far a cancer have brought you, um, that you're about to lose everything in your world, a cancer or a scorpion for some of you. And you're going to decide to give up this person because you're going to be recognizing, you know, you have... Uh, you know, drag me down this beautiful rotten rabbit hole and create this chaos for me. And I am going to be getting myself out of this. So this is what, you know, you Virgos are going to be doing. And you Virgos are going to be recognizing that a, a, a young cancer or square thing is very devious. It's a very devious person. And this is going to happen. Now, Virgos in your house, a lot of you Virgos are going to be dealing with institution. Um, government's institution, um, uh, banks, financial institution. You're going to be dealing and having to deal with these people. However, a lot of you Virgos are um, dealing with these issues. Okay. All right. Let's uh, break uh, this mund and see what's coming up. Miracle, a miracle. And someone is passing away. Pray for this person. V yeah. Vanity. They're not going to be recognizing that you Virgos 
lust because of vanity. You love vanity. Greed is a, a situation. Persevere. A lot of you Virgos are going to be persevering because a lot of you Virgos recognize that you know, you get caught up in a situation where there was some sort of a false, a Libra and created some sort of a false documentation. Expansion is going to be coming up and a lot of you Virgos is going to be cut in contact with a Leo person. And the situation is that you Virgo and this Leo created some sort of a mockery of a situation because you wanted to get back at someone. And this is what I don't understand, people. Retribution. Um you it, it create come on chaos for you as a person you know you're trying to have retribution on another person and it hits you so you virgo women you got to pray for a miracle to deal with a situation some of you virgos your child your daughter could end up in um some sort of a situation pray for this person mm, a lot of you virgos because of vanity you have enough but you still want more and you caught you're going to be um, caught, okay? All right. All righty. So persevere. A lot of you older Virgo women persevere. Um, it is hard, but try and persevere with whatever you're doing, whether it's work. Um, go through the cycle so that you don't have to come back as karma and work out things. They recognize that a Libran have a fraud here and created some sort of a fraud contractual agreement. So we look at expansion and a lot of you um, is going to be creating some sort of a outwards uh, um, how to create and expand on something. So it could be a house. You could be, um, you know, giving up your car, rolling your car um, for a truck but you're going to be creating expansion and I see it in the house. I see it in yourself and I see it where this expansion is going to be creating. So, you know, you could have a business that you're going to be extending it to another place, another city. Um, you could have products that you're going to be extending. So this expansion is very good because I see um, that you're really thinking of going public you know, really hitting and going public. And this is going to be good. So that's wonderful. So love. Love is here. And, I, I you know, love is here because a lot of you are going to be focusing on love. A lot of you are going to be understanding what it is and the love, that love is important. And it's as if you Virgos had choose money over love. And it's as if whatever is happening to you is hitting you and saying, hey, Virgos, um, you know, love is the most powerful thing in the world. And you choose um, money uh, over love and over a situation, rethink, um, you know, reconnect with yourself. Uh, whatever this is all about, you need to reconnect with yourself, okay? So, Virgos, it is all about love. You got to learn to love yourself. You got to learn to open up to love. You got to recognize that love is most important than materialistic things. And I see a lot of you, Virgos, is as if you're focused on materialistic things and not remembering the most important thing and it's love. Uh, so this is coming up because there is no new love that is coming in. It's basically um, coming up to say, open up to love. I do love you guys. I gotta go. Namaste. Please remember to like, share, thumbs up, subscribe. Namaste.